Hey everyone, my name's Pupsker, and today we're going over the best way to farm credits in Warframe. It's actually a fairly simple way. You need to go to the planet Neptune, and you need to go to the Index Endurance. This is, without a doubt, Warframe made this one of the best credit farming places in the game, specifically to farm day to day. The point of the index is as follows. You invest money into the mission, you do the mission, and then you get a guaranteed amount of credits back. So there are low, medium, and high risk investments. I would recommend always doing high risk, but if you're poor and have less credits at the time, or you don't have strong enough equipment, you can do lower risk investments. Either way, throw money in, beat the mission, and get money out. Your potential profit on low mission, 75,000, medium risk, 135,000, and high risk is 200,000. Very fun, right? So the idea is this, credit boosters also work while doing these missions, and uh, the lowest risk mission requires 50 points, the medium one, 75, and the high risk one, 100. And then you're also afflicted with financial stress, more so the higher the risked investment. So here's how it works. You use credit boosters and you definitely double the amount of credits you get, so it is recommended to do so, but obviously if you don't have credit boosters, you don't have credit boosters. I've farmed this a ton without credit boosters and it's definitely still a ton of credits for, per hour. You can easily get 1 to 2 million or hell 3 million if you go with a really good uh, optimized team. but pretty rare to get three mil an hour, so I wouldn't really bet on that at all. Anyways, high risk investment, that's what you'll do. This is how it works. You go into the mission, you kill the enemies, enemies drop index points, you pick up the index points, and then you hand in those index points until you have enough points that you beat the mission. Very simple, very easy, right? Haha. <laughs> no, not quite as easy. So, holding index points gives you a debuff and the game incentivizes you to hold more points because you get an index point bonus the more you hand in. So let's pop open the chart right now. As you can see, it is the most efficient to hand in 15 index points at a time. And this is the debuff that the index points give you. The more you hold, the bigger the debuff gets, reduces your max health, shields, and it constantly drains your energy. Yes, and it's in the top right in your HUD. And it's a massive pain. So, let's go over how to effectively do this. It's very simple. You collect 15 credits, hand it in. That's the min-max way to optimize it. But you need to hand in index points to actually get time to do the mission. So as long as you don't have, you know, you're not about to run out of time, you're good holding the credits. But if you're going to run out of time, yeah, time, sorry, hand in those credits. Unless you're at 15, then just hand them in. Very simple. The way I would recommend doing this is I would just pug it. Either take a Warframe and set up that does a ton of damage, or take a Warframe and set up that can hold a lot of points without using energy. So a tank that doesn't need a ton of energy, because if you hold a lot of credits, they will get sapped. So that is why I always pick Rhino, he's a very simple, easy Warframe. You just throw on your armor, you do some buffs if needed, and then you go do some damage, collect points, hand them in at 15. Other people can take, I don't know, Mesa and just do all the damage and kill everything and then let the Rhino hand it in. It's really up to you. All are viable strats and it's a very easy thing to do in the game. So this is, without a doubt, Warframe's made credit farming in the game. So go farm it to your heart's content. That's the end of my video, guys. If you liked it, throw me a sub, subscribe, you know, comment on if it was actually good, like my videos, or check out all my other stuff. Follow me on Twitter and Twitch as well. I'll stream there eventually, and I will announce it when I do on my channel in the community tab. So thank you, and goodbye. Peace.